Hello everyone, this is Harsha. Welcome to my channel Crypto English. So hi guys, in today's video, we'll talk about Aptos full node setup with a complete demo. So I'll show from start to end. Even if you're not a developer, I'll be making a simple single line code with which you can set up your complete Aptos node. So everything will be covered in this video. Watch this video till end. Before starting the video, if you're here for the first time, subscribe to the channel. If you like the video, click the like button. If you have any doubts or clarification, leave them in the comments below. So let's begin the video, guys. So first thing uh, to set up this node, you need to have a VPS server. So most of our computers don't have that much uh, uh, specifications which were required. So we will be purchasing the VPS. So I'll show how you can purchase that. So I'm using this specific website. This website link will be in the description below. You all you need is you just need to register and log in. So in case if you are an Indian user after logging in on the left side, you have to go to payment method and you have to load the fund. So if you directly purchase the make the order and try to purchase with the debit or credit card, Indian cards are not allowed. So you can just enter $32 and recharge account and you can complete the transaction with your cards and then your funds will be loaded. So once you load the funds into this website, you just need to go to this virtual uh, private servers uh, link where you can purchase them and you need to select the third option which is showing around $19. So that is because uh, the minimum hardware requirement for this setup is eight core processor. So that is only available in this third option. So we can select that and next screen you just need to uh, you need not change anything. You can just scroll down a little and in the fifth point you will see something called your password. So just come to the fifth page until then you don't change anything. So in the fifth page you can see username will be root and your password you can type or enter your password and you need to remember the password. So only with that password you will be able to access your VPS. So after that you just come down and click on next and in the next page you just need to uh, give your address and other details or if you have a login you can directly log in. Then in the next page you need to click on order and pay option. And once you click on order and pay you, as you are already loaded $32 into your wallet, so that order will be successful. So now once that is completed, you will receive an instant email which will show you the order status and after uh, like uh, 30 to 40 minutes, your IP address will be created and your uh, VPS will be available and you will receive an email uh, with some details like this where you can see your IP address. So now first step is completed. So second step you need to download a software to access your VPS. So we are using Putty. This is for the Windows. So you can just click on download. Just come to this page, download this 64-bit uh, extension and just click on that and it will directly open up. So now next step is the IP address which you have received into your email. You just need to enter that IP address here in the host name and then click on open. So once you click on open, Putty page will be open and you just need to accept some uh, condition. And after that, you can see the login as here you need to enter your user ID and password what you have created so user ID will be root and password whatever you have set the password that password you have to enter. So when you are typing the password it won't show anything as if you are typing so but it will be uh, working so then just click on enter and now you can see you are successfully connected to your VPS server through Putty software. So now to make it easy so if you see this complete installation document so there are multiple commands you have to run and it will take lot of time and if you do any mistake your node will be uh, not running successfully. So to simplify that uh, there is a website I found this this is a uh, notes guru website so they have published a single line script uh, great shout out to this guy so you just need to copy this and with that you will be able to set up your node. So I'll just copy this one line code then come to this page and if you want to paste anything into this page you just need to right click on your mouse so just right click that code will be pasted and click on enter. Then you can see node guru page has come and it will be asking you to enter the node name. So you can enter your preferred name. So I'm entering crypto Telugu and just click on enter. Once you enter that your node installation will start successfully. So you need not do anything within five minutes. Uh, node guru script will install the uh, complete Aptos node and it will be up and running and your node will be set up within five minutes of time without any coding. So now you can see your Aptos node installed and works. So now once you receive this message that means your node is up and active to, to revalidate all you can do is you can head over to this node validation page here you can just enter your IP address and port will be 80 and click on connect and then you can see if everything is seen as green that means your node is running successfully without any issues. So now our road is ready. So now before closing this you need to copy certain information to fill the uh, testnet uh, that incentivized testnet form. 
So now to do that, here you need to copy another code. So in same uh, Node Guru's page, if you scroll down information for filling the form, you will see two line code. You just copy both the lines, copy it, come to Putty software, just right click and then click on enter. So once you enter, you will get couple of details like address, uh, uh, account address, account public key and multiple details. Just copy this entire thing and paste it in your notepad and save it somewhere safely. So because you need these details while doing the registration. So now our node is ready. We have the details to fill the form. Now all you need is you just need to go to the website Aptos testnet page and here you can click on register node option. So here you have to log in with your Gmail and after that create your user ID and just click on continue. And after that just scroll down a bit and click on incentivize testnet and get started. So now in this screen you just again need to click on uh, register node. First thing is you need, you need to connect to your discard server and before that last date for uh, completing this uh, registration process is August 25th so that you should keep in mind. So now I just click on sign in and connect your discard account to this particular uh, uh, page and after that you will be your discard will be connected in the next screen you need to connect your wallet. So there is a specific wallet which need to be used if you click on learn more you will be able to see that screen. You will just head over to the screen here. You just need to click on wallet uh, release. Then click on wallet extension dot zip. And once you click that you will get a extract a zip file. Just extract the file and keep that folder somewhere safely. Now you go back to your Chrome. Click on extension. Click on manage extensions. And there you can see load unpacked and then select your unzipped wallet. So once you select uh, your uh, Petra Aptos wallet will be installed into your Chrome. Just open that, get started and register your wallet. So once the wallet is ready, you are all good to go and now you can go back to the registration page and link your wallet. So now let's go back to the registration page, click on connect and click on approve on your Petra wallet. So once you do that, your wallet will be connected. So now you have to save this wallet safely because in case if you are getting any incentive in this incentive as testnet, all those rewards will be loaded and uh, created to this specific account only. So now just come down, click on complete survey and click on continue. Here you will need to answer a couple of questions and once you submit, your form will be done and next step will be node registration. So here you have to click on register. Now you have to do the node registration. Owner key will be automatically populated from your wallet which is connected and then you have to give this consensus key, consensus POP, account key and validator network. So all those details are already available in this specific screen where I told you guys to copy this text. You can just copy paste that and if you scroll down you just need to enter your IP address just enter your IP address of the uh, uh, host uh, like where you have hosted your VPS and then API uh, uh, and full node details is optional thing you need not enter these details and you need to change your I API port to 80 and then click on validate once you do that you will it will take some two to three minutes time and after a couple of minutes you will see a uh, node validation successful. Then once you get this message again you have to click on validate node and your validation will be completed. So now you can see successfully my e registration is completed and final and important step is I have to complete the identity verification before 27th August. I can click on verify. I can complete my KYC process and my uh, Aptos incentivized testnet registration is successfully completed. So that's all guys. This is very simple. So many users were very confused in the community to how to set up this. So I made it very simple with a single liner code and showed you A to Z in this. So hope you like the video and this was helpful for you guys. So if you have any doubts or clarification, you can leave in the leave them in the comments below or you can head over to the Aptos Discord channel and you can discuss discuss with the other uh, members of the community. So that's all guys. That is all about today's video. If you like this video, click the like button. If you have any doubts or clarification, leave them in the comments below. So that's all guys. Thanks for watching. Jai Hind.